Performing a weekly manual cleaning on your VersaCam can help to recover blocked or deflected printhead nozzles and is also important to keep your machine running at its best. To perform this cleaning, you'll need a cleaning stick with a sponge head, printer cleaning solution, and paper towels. These cleaning kits are available from allgraphicsupplies.com. You may also want to keep the instructions from your Roland VS manual nearby as well. Start by selecting the cleaning function, found under Menu, Submenu, then Maintenance. Remove the panel cover on the left side when the VersaCam asks you to. It will then ask you to remove the cut rail. The cut rail is held in place by a single white screw which can be removed by hand. Once it's removed, lift the cut rail out of place and put it aside. Press enter after removing the cut rail. The machine will now ask you to place the panel cover back on the left side. Place the cover back on, but don't insert the screws on top. If the front cover is open on the verse cam, the machine will begin beeping and prompt you to close it. Once it's closed, the head carriage will travel to the left side of the printer. You can now open the covers on both sides of the printer. It doesn't matter which side you open first, as long as the left side is opened at the same time. Discharge any static electricity you may have built up by touching the frame on the right side of the first cam. Pour a few drops of cleaning solution on the stick, covering each side. It's better to pour the solution onto the stick rather than dip the sponge into the solution, since you don't want to possibly contaminate the cleaning solution at all. We're going to start with the bottom of the head carriage. Wipe the metal frame around the surface of the head, cleaning off any excess ink that might have built up. Be sure not to touch the surface of the head itself, as you might scratch the printing area. Next, clean the rubber wiper on the right side of the VersaCam. Wipe both sides of it until any buildup ink has been removed. If the wiper looks like it needs to be replaced, you may want to do that once we're done this cleaning. Follow the instructions in our AGS tutorial for that procedure. Once you've cleaned the wiper, pour a few drops of cleaning solution into the cap as well. The solution should sit for a second or two, then drain. If the solution sits on top of the cap without draining, you may have a clog in your capping system and it's recommended that you have a Roland certified technician take a look at the issue. Clean the metal frame around the cap top as well, but avoid touching the sponge surface of it with your swab. Place the left cover back on the machine, then the right cover as well. Once they're on, press enter and the head will return. The machine will now prompt you to install the cut rail. Pull off the left cover, then insert the cut rail into the slot on the VersaCam. Use the white screw to secure it back into place. Once the cut rail is in, you can replace the left cover and secure it with the two black screws at the top of the cover. The machine will perform its own cleaning once all covers have been attached and you've pressed enter. After it completes this, do a test print to check the firing quality of your head. You should be getting all nozzles firing consistently and without deflections. If not, perform a powerful cleaning from the maintenance menu to try and recover any additional nozzles. All Graphic Supplies offers tuna packages to help keep your machine running at its best. Contact your local office to book a Roland Certified Technician today.